G'day, welcome to Todd's Kitchen. A couple of weeks ago I made a rolled grilled cheese sandwich and everyone seemed to have loved it. So I thought I'd follow up with a sweet version. So join me today as I make my version of a cinnamon and cream cheese roll. Okay, so to start this off, into a mixing bowl we're going to place in our cream cheese. I'll leave the list of ingredients in the description down below. And to that, our icing sugar or powdered sugar. And using a hand mixer or a stand mixer, we're going to beat this through until it's well combined. Next I have four slices of bread. Now you can use white bread like I'm using now, or you can also use wholemeal. So what I've done is I've cut the crust off the outside of all of them. And now using a rolling pin, we're going to roll them all out nice and flat. Next with our cream cheese mixture, we're going to put a light coating on each one. Just like you're buttering the bread. And now grabbing each one, we're going to carefully roll them up. Now that they're all rolled up, I have some butter here that I've just melted in the microwave. And using a pastry brush, get some of that butter. And I'm just going to butter the outsides. Next into a separate bowl, we're going to pour in some caster sugar and then some ground cinnamon. And just give that a quick mix around. And with our cinnamon sugar mixture, we're just going to cover each roll. And turn them around as well, just so we can do both sides. Next, we've got a baking tray here lined with non-stick baking paper, and we're just going to place each one right onto that. Okay, so now we're going to place this into a preheated oven at 180 degrees Celsius for 7 minutes. And after 7 minutes, we're going to roll them over and cook them for a further 7 minutes. Okay, so I've just taken them out of the oven, and I've let them cool down for a few minutes, just so I don't burn my tongue. But they are done, and they were incredibly easy to make. But the big test is, let's see what they taste like. Mm. Oh, that is so good. That really, really is good. It has a very slight crunch on the outside with that warm, lovely cream cheese taste. Top that off with some lovely cinnamon sugar. These cinnamon and cream cheese roll-ups taste simply delish. So next time you're having friends over, or even if you're by yourself, give them a go because you will love them. They really are a super simple and easy sweet treat to make. Thank you for watching this episode of Todd's Kitchen. As always, the list of ingredients are down below, as well as links to my Facebook, Twitter, and Home Handy Hints channel. Please do me a huge favor by giving this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time for another delicious recipe.